All right, everyone, welcome back to the channel. So this past weekend, uh, we ended up going to Super Nintendo World for the first time. And we wanted to share just a couple of quick snapshots of kind of what it looked like. We're going back in a couple of weeks and uh, we'll do a little bit more in-depth uh, filming there. But here's kind of what we saw. It was very packed after um, the early check-in that we were able to do. Uh, spending the extra, I think it was $25 to get in early. After that, I got extremely packed and um, highly recommend checking in early or paying that extra $25 to get in early because you're able to enjoy some things and even make a uh, reservation at Toadstool Cafe before the general pu uh, public. And that sells out extremely quick. So, But here is the Toad Cafe, Toadstool Cafe. It's extremely cool. Kid loved it. Um, the food was awesome. And it was just a really good atmosphere. It was really nice to be uh, immersed in this Nintendo world. It really does um, put you in the games. Here's some of the food that we uh, picked up. Uh, it was awesome food, amazing food. This dish actually came with this special bowl, this Bowser bowl. Um, and here's some of the stuff we picked up. We'll do a little bit more in depth on a lot of this stuff, but just wanted to get something up real quick because we did go, we did have a good time and we highly recommend it. We're excited to go back in a couple weeks. And here's some photos that we took while we were waiting in line for the Mario Kart ride. Just some still images here. It was really cool, again, really immersive. Even if you are waiting in line for quite a long time, uh, you get to see all this Nintendo stuff, this Mario Kart stuff, and the time flies. I think ours uh, said it was like a 30 minute wait. It felt like five minutes. Uh, and it was just really, really fun and really cool to be immersed again in this Nintendo world. So highly recommend anyone that uh, is in the Hollywood area or, or wants to go on a family vacation, take your kids there. But if you do know, you have to enter a queue to get in after a certain time and sometimes it sells out. So highly recommend if you're gonna go, pick a day where you can get that early access into Nintendo World. You get a, uh, an hour before the general public and it's, it really makes it worth it. Highly recommend that. Otherwise, you're gonna just expect to be in long lines all day and maybe not make it to the Toadstool Cafe because that reservation was gone almost within the first hour of the park being open. So, uh, but thanks for watching. Stay tuned uh, for our next video and uh, appreciate the support.